cutting our investment on innovation and education. Again, cutting our investment in innovation and education. That's like making an overloaded airplane lighter by removing its engine. It may make you feel as if you are flying high one minute, but it's only a matter of time before you feel the impact. Our keynote speaker was elected as the first Premier of the Mpumalanga province back in 1994 and went on to serve as the Treasurer General within the Executive Committee of the ruling or serving party from 2007 to 2012. More this morning at the launch of the uh, mobile laboratory of the MSDT, Dr. Matthew Sporza. Today marks a momentous step forward to for mobile agri-skills development and training as we shift up a gear and take into possession the very first mobile laboratory for emerging farmers in South Africa. This revolutionary mobile laboratory with this cutting-edge technology will strengthen MSDT's hand in accelerating the growth of emerging farmers into commercial producers even further. It will ensure a more serious contribution towards agrarian revolutionary skills. This country, and indeed the whole continent, has got a lot of land, but very little skills to engage that land. It is clear that the future of food production and rural job creation lies with South Africa's 2.5 million emerging farmers. However, the South African agricultural economy has to create room for them. And being an emerging farmer can be a challenging venture without a strong enough support system. And of a three million donation, three million donation by CEDA. Let's give them an applause. <laughs> CEDA have sponsored our CEDA Mpumalanga Agricultural Skills Incubator who shall forever be grateful. You have set a good example, which is going to be difficult to follow, but which must be followed. The laboratory will be used for soil testing, water testing, and plant and leaf testing, according to SABS and SANA standards. It will also bring to the rural areas technical services, including training to farmers study groups, GSP positioning, and mapping, and a range of tools effective for repair, repairing and maintaining infrastructure on farms. Exciting also is that the mobile laboratory will visit schools. It's mobile, it's called wheels. It's knowledge on wheels. And having been equipped with electronic and basic science equipment as well as two television screens for broadcast, it will indeed make students aware of basic agri-science and show that agriculture is an indeed a proud and worthwhile profession. Dr. Rob Davies usually speaks about creating this pool of incubators that can be comparable to Brazil, to India, for example. So there is um, a push from government to create more incubators because one, while they address the, the mortality rate of small businesses, they also really create um, viable and sustainable small businesses. So the second one would be incubation. We've also um, prioritized access to markets, local and foreign markets, as another um, priority set of organization going for. There's lots of initiatives we're currently working on, especially revising our, ac our access to export market um, opportunities. On the service offerings that we, we offer within our incubation program, we really need to provide end-to-end -end support for incubators in our program. So I think this is one initiative of trying to expand the, the services that we provide to incubators. To uh, give us a perspective on the STP's role, uh, the SDP Acting Executive Manager. Let's welcome Mr. Sipiwo Soba. For any business is opportunity. Sometimes you have the opportunity and if there are so many regulations and hurdles in front of you, you lose the opportunity. And business is about that. When you miss and lose the opportunity, chances of getting it are actually not there. Um, you know, capacity with regards to technology. This is one of our drive to develop capacity. This is the capacity we're developing that this track can even move, you know, throughout uh, the province in terms of.
Our framework is really to change the lives of people in rural areas and to nurture our emerging farmers to become very successful. Jesus, take the wheel, take it from my hands, cause I can do this all by own. I'm letting go, so give me one more chance, and save me from this road I'm on. Jesus, take the wheel.